One such time when um, we were doing some deal of uh, work, uh, we uh, found one interesting thing is that uh, you know we are a group of about 120 people here working together, and any time during the during the flu season or during the time when people get common cold and you know when the weather changes and so on, uh, so uh, people used to get sick. And uh, it was around the same time that uh, we uh, developed this technique uh, called the PMEE, the uh, uh, photon mediated electron emission technique for a different purpose. So uh, there is a time when we thought, okay, let's see if uh, this would work on uh, influenza because it's very similar in, uh, you know, in structure of uh, uh, the, the coronavirus. But then at that time there was no um, a typical uh, coronavirus infection. So we implemented this in our campus in 2018, around I think now but December of 2018. And one year after, uh, in 2019, we took it seriously. Then we uh, made the device much more uh, closer to what we want. And uh, in, in February, uh, the pandemic was al almost setting in into the country uh, in February 2020 and we uh, didn't have laboratories here who could test the efficacy. You see when you put a, a device into the, uh, into the market for real use, uh, you need to be sure of its safety and uh, you know it should be sure of its efficacy because it's going to be widely used and so on. So we needed to get all the necessary uh, approvals and clearances. So we had to send it to laboratories uh, outside the country and uh, you know we had to take all the safety tests which was uh, many of them were done within the country, some were done outside the country and um, you know we had to do uh, bacterial studies so that we know that it doesn't affect the good uh, bacteria that is there and uh, so we had to do many uh, of these studies before uh, we could uh, actually bring it into the market. Shaikokan, let's bring life back to normal and normal back to business. Visit shaikokancorp.com today. Shaikokan, now available on Amazon India.